Hey, what's up guys? It's Rojo, back with some more Hyrule Warriors, and we are going to continue Legend Mode. This time, uh, we'll take a, uh, quick stroll through the Faron Woods, it looks like. And we have some options of who to play with, but we did just get a new weapon for Link, which I'm definitely interested in checking out. Uh, one thing I do want to do, though, is I got some costumes just from DLC and pre-order and all that kind of good stuff, so I figured maybe switch it up. Um, the, uh, yeah, the Twilight one looks pretty good, I think. I also have Dark Link, which, uh, you know, it's all, always cool to check out. But I think we'll do, we'll do Era of Twilight this time around. And we will use our magic rod. <laughs> That's, uh, hopefully, uh, not as dirty as it sounds. Um, and, yeah, wow, the weapon is... Well, I guess all our weapons are kind of weak. This one seems particularly weak, but that's okay. Link and his allies were saved from the dangers of the Elden Caves by a mysterious youth named Sheik. Joined by their new ally, Impa's troops exited the caves and emerged in Farron Woods. There, they found a hidden village overrun with monsters. While Link and Impa wanted to continue their search for Zelda, they could not ignore the plight of the villagers. Without hesitation, they sprang into battle. Alrighty. Take a quick peek at the uh, battlefield info. Ah, we have somebody named Lana, apparently, joining us. Bunch of Hylian captains. Uh, but, uh, you know, best, uh... Thing to do is probably just to get started. Seems like kind of a raw deal. <laughs> I don't recognize Lana from any uh, other Zelda games, so uh, I guess she must be a new character to the, the series. This uh, fire staff, oh there we go, yeah that's interesting. Not too bad. <laughs> it's like a quintuple flamethrower or something like that I guess. And uh, that's pretty sweet. Pretty sweet gun effect going on. Nice, we got a little fire column. Uh, what, what else we got going on here? Let's uh, take a look. Deku Baba. I don't think we can. I don't know if we can do anything about this guy. Let's see. Can't get through there. Nice thing turns into like an axe as well. That's pretty. It's pretty crazy. That fire thing went went all over the place too. Like way, uh, <laughs> way across the whole divide. Oh, okay, cool. It looks like we're gonna be getting a, uh, a new item. Let's see. Uh, let's see what we can do. We'll get this outpost on the way, I suppose. Yeah, the fire column's not too bad. Looks like we got one, two, three, four, and five. Yeah. One, two, three, four. Oh, I guess I messed that one up. Ah, okay, yeah, the four is our uh, flamethrower. That makes sense. 
I'm gonna say, yeah, this weapon is kind of cool, a little awkward to use, <laughs> in my opinion. Um, definitely prefer the sword, I think. Okay, so uh, let's look around this village some more. I'm assuming we don't want to walk into the purple uh, nastiness. And what do we got? Oh, hey. Right here. Is this the bow? Ah, indeed it is. Excellent. We can target and attack strong enemies. And uh, I didn't catch what that the, last, the first part of that was. I forgot what it was already. <laughs> but no worries. Um, all right, yeah, let's try it out. Boom! Nice. One shot. Uh, one shot in Deku Babas. Looks like these guys have bows too, actually. A little annoying to get plinked over and over. Uh, here's another uh, Deku Baba. Deal with this guy. And we got a bomb power up, which we can't really do anything with. Let's take this base, shall we? Oh, nice. Yeah, the bow like pierces. Uh, it's, it's pretty cool stuff. Everybody's <laughs> everybody's just standing around though, like, oh, what do we do? Do we uh, fight them? And uh, I mean, the answer is yes. Yes, you, you fight them. But uh, I think we'll uh, have this keep in short order, and then we can move on to other Deku Babas. We tried our bow on this guy. Doesn't really do very much damage, but that's okay. Nice, alright. So, Deku Baba. Next one, here we go. Oop, that, that doesn't feel too good. Alright. How many more? Two more to go. And then there's like a ton of guys all over this map. It's pretty crazy. Um, just like in, in general, uh, uh, not necessarily right next to us at the moment, but uh, looks like we'll get this. Uh, ooh, hang on. Let's switch to bombs and boom. Good use of the bomb power up. Oh, and there's nothing there. What a disappointment. <laughs> oh, well. Okay. Uh, back to the bow. Oh, don't want to miss this material. And we'll shoot this guy. And I think we're good. We need to bust this gate down. There we go. Alright. We'll definitely be taking this outpost. I think, uh, yeah, I think I like this, like, three attack the best out of uh, all the attacks with this weapon. That's, uh, yeah, it seems to be... Because the other one just sort of makes you stand around for too long sometimes, in my opinion. But not in this case. That was pretty, pretty solid use of it. It's got a pretty good AoE, I guess, like, from a frontal standpoint. What else? Uh, I thought we had a 5 attack, but I guess we don't. Whoa! <laughs> I don't know what's going on there. Okay, we'll take this base. Whoa! What's this guy all about? Oh, he's uh, like a redead. Oh, and they do exactly what you would expect them to do, which is uh, stun you for a year. Okay, gotta get this base ASAP. Wonder if we can just shoot him with the bow. Yeah, <laughs> just over and over. It doesn't do much damage, but uh, it's it's amusing if nothing else. Oh, he's out of range. All right. Oh no, a little bit more. One more. And then, what, I guess we gotta, like, move into the, the circle? Yep. <laughs> oh, man. Wow, okay. I mean, that's a pretty cool effect for this weapon. Oh, yeah, we can do the, uh, 
Let's do the uh, special attack. Whoa. Wow, we just annihilated those guys. Oh, arrows powered up. That's interesting. Wonder how is this looking? Oh yeah, that's uh, that's not too shabby. A little bow of light action by the looks of it. Okay, we have to defeat the Gibdo forces. Um, well, we already got some of them, but uh, I think we need to get a little bit more. Oh, we can't go this way. <laughs> My mistake. We're gonna go around. I think like this, perhaps. Yeah, here we go. Get some! Oh, ow. <laughs> there we go. Alright, one down. Ow. I think this will probably take care of him. <laughs> Just a hunch. <laughs> Alright. So we got that guy. We got the other guy. Just want to make sure we get all the materials, because we definitely want those. Okay. Oh, there's more Gibdo forces still. Okay. No big deal. We'll get them too. Looks like we might need to retake an outpost real quick, uh, just for safety's uh, sake. Alright, what you got, Gibdo? I'm coming for you! This is where the rest of my guys are. I hope I was facing the right way for that. Uh, uh, nope. Somehow facing backwards. Well done, well done. <laughs> That's okay, though. Man, we... That, that stun is brutal. Lasts for so long. Alright, this guy's down. Who's next? Oh, we have a we have a volunteer. All right. Now what? Anybody? Anybody else? Anybody else? Yes, no. Think. Uh, oh, we got a weapon. That's pretty cool. All right. We definitely want to pick up this uh, outpost captain. I think. I think this is, that's a, that, that's a pretty good attack too. Just your uh, fifth basic attack. Um, all right, so we got that. Oh no, Deku Tree! What a jerk. Okay, I guess. Uh, we don't have time for this. I don't. Uh, well, maybe we have time. If we're fast. We'll grab this, and then we'll get. Uh, We'll save, we'll save Deku Tree. I mean, he is on fire, but uh, he'll be fine. You know, it'll be great. I have, I have faith. All right. Keep boss down. And finally, we will go get the Deku Tree, hopefully. Man, they retook that, that outpost I just took. Oh, we, there's a great fairy nearby. Okay. But where? Retake this outpost yet again. This guy's really need to uh, take the hint. There we go. Okay. Um, put out the fire where... Oh, where is the fairy, though? Go, 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 go! I'm hoping maybe over this o this away. Oh, in the northeast? Let's uh, hurry this up, then, since we're already here. Alright. A gold sculpture. Oh my god. So many objectives right now. Alright, we gotta go back and get the sculpture. Must do it. But then we really have to go get that fairy. We're gonna have to wait and do the uh, 
the southeast tree later. Alright, be very, very quiet. We're hunting Skulltraws. Oh, I hear... I hear something. Where are you? Right over here? Yes! Awesome. Okay. Now we gotta book it. Oop, wrong way. I think we wanna probably go this way. I'm just gonna have to skip like all these outposts and get them later. Okay, alright. We're here. Everything's great. Everything's fine. Nothing is ruined. Yet. Well, except for... We're just gonna hang out with a goofy look on our face for a bit. Okay. Gibdo is down. Yet again, another is, is uh, defeated. And uh, we can open up... Ooh, there's a chicken. If you ever play the Zelda game, you should know this is probably a bad idea. Okay, let's do this first. <laughs> this is uh, important. What is happening? They are <laughs> building a rain cloud, okay. Okay. Now this chicken is gonna be dinner! His health doesn't go down though, I find this to be very strange. Come on, chicken, what else you got? Yeah, this guy is just not, uh... Not going down. Oh, oh, there we go. I guess we had to, like, knock him out of the thing. Beware Cuckoo's counterattack. Psha. Oh, there he goes. Okay, now what are we missing? Anything, anything, anything? No, I think we're good. Okay. Let's, uh... Acquire some... Oh my god, Cuckoos. What are you doing? Oh my god, there's so... There's so many Cuckoos. Oh, but there's a big one. We can we can take out this big cuckoo. This is awesome. <laughs> oh man. These guys are just out of control. Alright, we don't we don't have time for this. They can follow us and fight us fight us there if they want to. Whoa, cuckoo receive reinforcements again! Now he's got... There's a gold one. We are gonna have to seriously... Kick the crap out of that cuckoo. If we could get on stun for like two seconds. That'd be great. Alright, give those down. Cuckoo, you are next. Actually, you know what? Let's, uh... Yeah, let's magic it up. Alright, cuckoo. You're about to become fried chicken. <laughs> Man, that knockback. Just annihilated all these. These things are laying eggs as they die. What the heck is that all about? 
I don't know how many more of these guys I have to wreck. Jeez. Oh, keep boss. I've been completely ignoring the keep boss. <laughs> there we go. Get a couple guys to maybe uh, help out with this battle. All right. We're almost. We almost got this uh, golden cuckoo. Where would he go? Where would he go? Oh, there he is. We'll just uh, use our arrow power up since we got it, I guess. Almost done. Almost done. So close. How long is this power blast for, like, ever? Alright, Gold Cuckoo, you got nothing. Alright, let's finish up. Get the skip dough, and then we're gonna go down, I think, to that other castle and grab that real quick. Just in case there's a chest there, primarily. Um Alrighty, where'd he go? There we go. Let's grab that. Alright, south. And these these chickens just do not want to let up. Alright, keep boss. We'll just go ahead and one-shot him, I think. Yep, <laughs> and it uh, looks like we saved a uh, an ally by the looks of it. Okay, yeah, we we own pretty much this whole map now. Chicken, please. All right, just in the interest of grabbing all the map. Oh, nice, Sheik actually. <laughs> took control of a uh, one one area but yeah I'm thinking check what's up here and then maybe grab that last uh, grab that last thingy uh, outpost and then we'll go defeat Wizro yet again all right nothing uh, nothing else going on back here by the looks of it um, so we shall press on All right. Outpost is ours, and we have basically total, basically total map control, um, with the exception of, well, no, I guess everything. Um, we, yeah, with the exception of the enemy keep, <laughs> of course. Oh, our guys have high morale too. Excellent. All right, Wizro, I'm coming for you. I wonder. I feel like yeah. There, I, I need to figure out what the block button is. Because I forgot to look at the controls. Oh, where'd he go? What's this all about? Nice, we get to 1500. What's this? Nice. Another classic uh, Zelda enemy. Whoa, where you go? Uh oh, no, I don't think we want to be underneath that. <laughs> All right. What's the uh, ow? There we go. That's it. We just gotta wait for him to uh, shoot, I guess. All right, we got him halfway. We'll get him. We'll get him next time. Oh, keep boss is here. Let's see if we can just uh, get him real quick, just because you know why? Why not? There we go. Okay, Goma, let's uh, let's do this. Just me, you, and uh, you know, like all these other guys. But you know, it's it's still fair. It's fine. Definitely curious what the uh, super attack is going to be with this rod. Oh, we, we didn't quite get him. That's crazy. I don't agree with that at all. Alright. This time, for sure. Oh, that's brutal. Right in the eye. Want to see if I can get uh, some magic uh, real quick. Oh wow, health full. I don't 
recall having uh, ever made a potion, but that's fine. Is there a magic thing in here, though? I guess not, no. Um, okay, no worries. No worries, we'll just do it the old-fashioned way. Whoa! That's rude. Okay. <laughs> it's a little too close for comfort. Come on, come on, come on. One more... One more laser thingy. There we go. Alright, let's see what we can do here. This is, I don't think this special is going to be enough. No, not even close. Oh, so close though. Where's the laser at? He does not want to cooperate at all. There it goes. Nice. A solid, uh, solid finish. Got a new weapon. Pretty, uh, pretty awesome. Huh, apparently she can heal as well. So somber. For generations, Hyroleans have told the tale of the war across the ages. This is how it begins. Deep in the forests, far from mortal eyes, a great sorceress watched over the balance of the Triforce. Through her magic, she could see across ages, able to read the fates of all who lived, but never interfering. That is until a unique soul caught her attention. The soul of the hero of legend, eternally reborn when Hyrule's need is greatest. Through her powers, the sorceress should have seen that the hero was bound to another. Instead, she saw only a soul that was unlike any she had known. And while the sorceress was preoccupied, a fragment of darkness, locked in its prison, saw an opportunity. The whispering darkness wormed its way into her heart. It pushed the light away and warped her curiosity into a desperate desire to possess the legendary hero's soul. Of course, this evil had its own desires. To use the Triforce to resurrect itself and conquer Hyrule once again. Having pushed the light from her heart, the darkness compelled her to open the gate of souls, the doorway of time itself. 
Monsters from across the ages pour through the gate, bringing ruin to the land of Hyrule once more. All right, that was a uh, fairly long bit of backstory for this game, um, but uh, good to know. Looks like uh, we got a bunch of money. Always nice. New fire rod, slightly better. I have no idea what Stars Plus is, but uh, we got another Impa weapon and another Impa weapon. Strong attack plus. I'll we'll have to look up what those do at some point. Two heavy Gibdo swords. Six Gibdo bandages and a partridge in a pear tree. Uh, or at least 22 metal plates. Oh, we unlocked Lana. Very cool. The smithy is open for business. We can uh, now combine weapon skills by fusing weapons. That's interesting. Let's, uh, yeah, let's take a look and see what we got. Uh, Link's probably got a bunch of weapons. Select a base weapon. Um, well, we did just get a new rod with a thing, I think. Oh, no, I guess not. Maybe, maybe not those weapons. So select a, a weapon to enhance. Yeah, so I guess uh, maybe this one. And then we can transfer skills at the smithy. So we select the source weapon. Slots plus, I don't know what that does. I don't know what really any of these do, except for perhaps these, well, I guess I know what those two do, but uh, this seems interesting. Let's transfer from this one. Oh, okay, I see. Increases the chance of a many slotted weapon drop. Yeah, sure, why not? And then we fuse the weapons. Ah, okay, I see. So we basically, yeah, we moved the ability from one weapon to another, um, and the attack power stayed the same. I assume maybe the attack power would either become that of the source weapon or the base weapon. I'm not sure, but we'll try that out again sometime. Nothing new in the apothecary. Training dojo. Um, I think we'll just save our money for the moment. I'm, I'm curious, actually, what, what level it is. Lana is level 10, so... That is good. Uh, let's see what we can give her for badges, shall we? Of course, empty bottle. And down here, nothing. Attack badge. Give her a new combo attack for the Book of Sorcery, okay. Oops, I didn't <laughs> exit that screen just a hair too early. Uh, I didn't see what we got, but uh, nonetheless. So she can take keeps a little bit more quickly. That's uh, always nice. Oh, cool. So I guess for every uh, item, we'll get like a new uh, tier of abilities that we can level up. Um, so we had bombs, and now we have bombs and arrows. Interesting. And let's take a look. What else we got? Link can also make use of this, I think. Yes, with metal plate. Might as well uh, grab one of those. And uh, sure, let's use a couple of our Lizalfo scales to upgrade his Goron's bracelet. And Impa. Now has a new combo attack for the Giant's Blade. Excellent. Oops. Uh, and then uh, Sheik has a couple things it looks like she can unlock. 
using Gibdo bandages. Interesting. Um, I'm not sure what element, but we'll definitely give her a hornet larva. Just uh, to give her something kind of generally useful. Same deal with uh, the, the assist badge here. Oh, and she can also... I think I'm going to save Gibdo bandages for the moment. And, uh, yeah, I think that'll be everybody. Awesome. So, uh, yeah, we made it through the Farron Woods, and, uh, I believe next we'll be going to the Valley of Sears. That or maybe we'll do some, uh, some, uh, adventure mode, perhaps, or challenge mode, just to mix it up and see, uh, what else there is. But until then, my name has been Rojo, and thanks for watching.